4937. Here's my new Happy Meal toy. Complete detail look. Yeah, 2022. I was not gonna get this because I thought it was gonna be something. But this was unexpected. I, I was expecting a toy, but. Let's see what I know. Oh, there we go. Chicago, Illinois. And it didn't, it, it only came with this. This is my sister's item, so she's gonna keep it because I already have too much stuff in my room. Yeah. I'm not gonna decorate it because it's gonna become ugly and then the sticker is just gonna go to waste in the future, so I'm just gonna leave this here. The bucket is really nice. Look at that. Alright, this is what it looks like. Let's see, click the back of this piece of paper that came with the bucket. This would go like this as a lid, but because this item, there's items in here, just gonna leave it like that. Here is an update on my in my room. So I fixed this lock here, so that's already fixed and. Yeah, this is video 4937, and I'm gonna start not making too many videos, so this is probably gonna be a long video because I wanna save. I don't wanna pass video 5 point in before Black Friday, and that'll be probably worse because that's something really special that's gonna have. And next year, Valentine's Day is gonna land on Tuesday, and I might go out that day to do something like the mall, film some more stuff. But yeah, this is what I did in my closet. So I we I organized all this. This used to be messy. And this too. Nice and organized. I'm gonna put a, a shelf right here to put like um, like this stuff. Because this stuff is just gonna go here temporarily because we run out of fingers. This is what the lock looks like. Turn this on and turn this off. See? This right here is an emergency string, just in case the door doesn't want to open. We can open it through there, I guess, because if these two strings were disconnected from this, then our items would be locked in here. And the only way to get it out is to like pull it hard, or you can probably just reach a little stick and try to push this down like that. Anyways. And here's something really special. My toilet. This toilet was made back in 2018 and it's now fixed. Fully fixed. See? I had to replace the entire rim, this cardboard, because the old one was just too old. Here's the inside. I can't stick my phone in there. But it stuck my old phone in there too. So th there is a handle, but the handle stuck in there. I still haven't completely fixed it yet. This is the this is a flushometer mechanism. You can see inside there, and there's a hole. And you just lift this up. And, and if this toilet was found at a park. The logo would be right there. It's a Bradley toilet. This flushometer is not original, and I put this spud in the future. I don't know what year. I think 2020 or 2021. But this thing was broken for some, for a long time, and it finally got to fix it. And here's my house. It's still. I'm. A, I think I'm gonna finish it tomorrow. And here are my five elevators. And then, yeah, so this is a quick update out of this toilet paper roll. And it did fall down in the bucket. And that's why I need a cover for the bucket and a cover for the sink. Not only could items couldn't get it in here and get, um, get wet, but also tiny particles like this can go down here and make a hole on the plastic and cause a leak so
and I need a cover for the bucket to prevent clothing from getting wet. Because that is water right there. Okay, this is my 1977 Color Wearworth and in the Hot Wheel connectors are in here. I took them out because I was playing with that toilet. But yeah, this is what it looks like in here. So my channel is from the fast food fighter playlist is updated and the video number playlist is updated. And I switched the video number playlist from numbers to letters because if I did numbers, that would be too much and the other playlists would be letters and that, would, that wouldn't be enough. So yeah. Okay, that's it for the closet. Also, look at this. So when you close the door, this is what I actually did. I put two pieces of Gorilla Tape. Um, oh, by the way, I got new Gorilla Tape because I ran out. But basically, I put two pieces of Gorilla Tape from here to here, and I put a painter's tape to protect the paint because it's gonna be like this if I don't, when I peel it off without this being right there, it's gonna be like this. So this is actually gonna hold this parenter from going this way, from actually moving away from the door. So, and I put this right here to um, to prevent the string from the string from getting caught. And here is my new. Well, I have Gorilla Tape, it's right here, and, yes, I don't want to get a copyright claim. I did get a copyright claim when I was filming the Elvergy's Penny, and I uploaded it to YouTube, and I got a copyright claim. But I adjusted it, I cut the copyright music off, and I no longer get um, copyrighted results. So I got this thing at Walmart, I think, this Wednesday. Um, it was, it's about the same price, so, yeah. I ran out, and the last time I got Gorilla Tape was April of this year. Well, anyways, that's gonna be it for this video. And here's my robot, and I put two pieces of tape to prevent this from, you know, ripping it off, because I, I did fix it up. I put extra reinforcement right there, and then that piece of cardboard is new. That's our replacement part. Here's one final thing before I end this video. That's right, I'm making a new building right here in the city. 1962. Three passenger elevators and two service elevators in the back. Those two, and then the uh, main staircase. Here's the top, and that'll be it for video 4937. And I'm not gonna make any more videos until next Friday.